Libra September G'day, readings. My magical friends. I'm Jo from Red Room Reiki and Readings and JJ Agnes, my pen name for the Wollstonecraft Legacy series. Enjoy your monthly reading. Hello Libra and welcome to your reading for September. I'm using my oracle cards today. I think that might do, I think. Oh, there's a little bit of touchy-touchy energy coming in on yours, unfortunately. So we're using my oracle cards. So each card has a character from my book series. So by looking at this, I kind of go, mm, okay, let's see where this is going, girlfriend. <laughs> so Now, the first one, you've got mirror. So uh, we've got, you don't have forever to achieve your goals. Live now. Keep adding dreams. Fully embrace what mortality gives you. Life is a gift. Appreciate it. So you can see here, you know, there's this gift of life and her taking the ibis and starting to fly. The next one we have here is run when you can, which is really interesting. Um, I had this before, actually. So run when you can. You can see that she's sitting near the water and she's in a cage. So there's some sort of entrapment around you or maybe a situation you don't want to purely be in and it might be time for you to get out of there. So we've got here, run when you can. When you feel uncomfortable, leave. When you get that creepy feeling, leave. When your body feels unsafe, leave. Never allow your politeness to stop your instinct to escape. You have a natural ability to detect danger and to protect yourself. So you first, your instinct first, your gut feeling first, your intuition first. If it doesn't feel right, it's not right. I just wish we could teach this to everybody when they were young. So this is the card here once again. And the third one is your soulmate. Love is in the air. And I know Librans, oh, don't you just love love? Particularly you girls. Oh, you're so romantic. And just, I mean, I'm only staring you up because I'm a Scorpio. Uh, so <laughs> totally different to Librians, you know, how we see, we, we're all about the sex, baby. Um, but for you, you're all about the romance and the love. So you'll just love this card. And he's a hunk of spunk, isn't he, Rogan? So love is in the air. For singles, get excited as a new person enters your life. Commit, uh, committed relationships will also benefit with renewed passion and lust. So there's the, the harshness is coming from the fact that you don't have forever you, you've got to realize that now is the time to act. And also you might be in a situation where you feel you can't act or that you're stuck and there's some sort of entrapment, but there's a possibility of great love. So, um, you know, I'm going to pick two out of this just to see. Yeah. Yeah. Both here are interesting. You've got the obstacles here. So the obstacle uh, rune here, there's things that need to be looked at. You need to have a good look at your life. What are you not saying to yourself? Are you living in illusion a little bit? Um, writing down what you really want in a practical manner, comparing it to maybe the fluffiness of your life at present may not match. Um, so your ideal life may be somewhat quite different to what your reality looks like at this moment. And we want to make your ideal life be the reality. And that means that you may need to leave situations, leave people, leave thought patterns, leave behavioral patterns, belief systems behind for this potential of great love that's going to come into your life, a soulmate energy. Um, and you are well protected, but it also suggests that you need to be protected or maybe you're feeling a little bit frightened at the moment. Maybe you're scared about where the world's going or where you're going, um, but we just want you to relax a little bit. So I do feel like quite heavy for you in September, a little bit of soul diving, deep dive into who you are as a person. Stop worrying about everybody else. The best way to manifest is to know ourselves really, really well and to actually really want what we want and what's going to be good for us. And I feel like this is going to be necessary for you, Libra. Um, you've got some real soul searching to do um, before you can really start to move forwards. And here you've got Marcus obsession. Um, stop. You are too focused on one vision, one thought, one person, one place, one idea, and it's making you unstable in all areas of your life. Seek help, counseling, or recognize patterns that cause this preoccupation. So it's coming in exactly as I felt it. So just so you know, I'm not bullshitting. Um, here you go. 
So I'm just going to pull another rune just to see uh, what advice you might need. Um, yes, everything's going to work out, divine timing. But it's also, you know, the way it's shaped is like the little, you know, when the sand falls through. So it is saying there's only so much time. Stop wasting your life is kind of what it's saying. Um, and I know that's hard. I would never ask you to do something I wouldn't be brave enough to do. And I'm brave. So I'm allowed to say it to you. That's how I feel like. It's like, you know what? You could be living such an extraordinary life with all that you need and require and would love to have. And Libra, I know that you're a daydreamer and that you want to have just this most beautiful picket fence. And who's to say you can't have it? Hope you enjoyed your reading. I'll see you next month.